This is the first video of the day, but it's 9 p.m. So good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Viber, say hello. Say hello to the vlog. Get it, Viber. Get it, Viber. Get it, Viber. Get it. Get it, get it, get it. Honestly, y'all, I haven't really done nothing today but play Sims because I needed a rest day. I needed a day of doing nothing because I just did too much this weekend. I was too active this weekend. So today, I'm about to get in the shower and then I'm getting back on Sims. I edited the video from last week and it was only a couple minutes. Like, it was like eight minutes long, maybe seven minutes long. So I'm kind of disappointed with how short it was. But... All I can do is make this one longer. So prepare for a long vlog, y'all. You want your toy? I'm scared. <laughs> just got out the shower and now I'm about to just lay down and play Sims until I'm ready to go to bed. But I'm gonna put the camera away for now. I've recorded a little bit of my Sims, but I'll put the camera away for now because I just wanna like rest and have a relaxing day before tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm gonna be grinding. Good morning and happy Tuesday. Once again, I'm spending the day in bed because Girl is so tired this week. I don't know why I'm so tired, but I am. And I don't want to get out of bed. Alright, so I'm in the car now. I'm about to leave because I'm going to OBGYN. I've been having cramps like every night, all the time, constantly. And it's really been interfering with my like day-to-day -day life so i need to go to OBGYN to get a diagnosis i don't know if they can really do anything about it but you know at least i would know what's the problem is what's causing it and i can think about what i want to do about it so let's leave let's go to OBGYN right now OBGYN and my appointment is in 15 minutes so I'm about to check in online and go into my appointment so I'll see you guys after and I'll let you know what the doctor says okay so I got out of OBGYN and they really didn't tell me nothing other than I just gotta go and get a ultrasound to see what's causing my cramp so I scheduled another appointment I'm getting an ultrasound on Monday so until then we're kind of still in the unknown area still struggling to sleep still struggling to live but it's okay but now I'm going to Dollar Tree she gets out of his therapy appointment we're gonna be going to true grits to get some dinner so that's why i only got some fruit from the market with my lunch slide because i don't want to be like on a full stomach but i also needed enough food to like keep me going so in like an hour we're gonna be going to true grits but until then i'm about to join my class and play some sims <laughs> Uh, we're going to True Grits. True Grits! Again. I'm back from dinner and I'm ready to get back on Sims. Honestly, I'm feeling very relaxed this week. I'm just trying to get my mood back up. I don't know, last vlog I was very like sad and depressed. So this vlog I'm focusing on self care. So we're getting back on Sims. Happy Wednesday! Today I am planning on using the morning time to just do laundry rest play sims i'm gonna go to therapy and then i'm gonna get dressed and go to class because i haven't been to this class in like two weeks and i need to go because i'm doing too much i'm doing too much <laughs> I'm 
super starving right now. So I'm going to comments and obviously it's Wednesday, so we wear letters today. And I'm going to go find some sorority sisters to sit with for lunch. Cause might as well, I'm hungry. And I got a lot of stuff to do, so I'm gonna be doing my homework and stuff. I got like stuff that I need to do for school, stuff that I need to do for the sorority. And I feel like if I do all of that now, I'll have time to play Sims later, right? I'm literally so pooped right now. And I just need to like go to my therapy session and get all this out of my head. Like I just need to process so much right now because I'm so like, He's heading to class. I'm going with him because I need to get outside. I feel like lately I've been skipping my Wednesday evening class every single week. And I feel like if I go with Fletcher to his class, I'm more likely to attend mine. <laughs> my camera in the car all day and I haven't left my apartment on campus so there's no footage for today I literally just spent the whole day in bed in my pajamas doing nothing but homework and studying and sorority stuff but now I have to eat Okay guys, so it's cycle day one today, so I'm very uncomfortable. I have a headache, I'm very thirsty, so I'm getting water, and I was thinking about taking another shower because I was kind of stressed, and I also have an exam tomorrow. Woo! I was thinking about taking another shower. I already took one this morning because I'm a little bit stressed, but I feel like instead of taking a shower, I should just place it. But first, I need to use the bathroom, so bathroom montage! Back in the kitchen, I spent like a, oh, I spent a very long time in the bathroom, so now I just want some juice. While I was in the bathroom, the water that I filled up spilled. It's so drenched right there. My head hurts really bad, so. I'm taking two Tylenol right now. Huh? The cranberry juice is already out. Oh, this cranberry juice really helps. It's like, I feel it right here, Fletcher. Mm. You think that's a sinus headache? Probably. I feel weird this morning. I don't know if it's because I had a bad dream or if I haven't drank enough water, but like, my throat feels dry right now and like, I don't know. <laughs> I think I really need to pay attention more in this class because, like, I don't really be knowing what's going on, to be honest. And then I also just, like, I have an exam today for this class, and I don't know. I don't really about to wing it. I have to leave, like, basically now but I still have a brush on teeth and stuff and I'm on my cycle so like there's things I have to do for myself before I leave and yeah we need to rush let's go okay so I'm heading up to class now I have 10 minutes to get there if I want to be there on time six, six minutes six, to seven. get there seven minutes to get there back for my exam and I think that I did decent on it I'm hoping and praying that I get like a 70 to an 80 percent on it because I want to be able to bounce back I mean obviously I know that I didn't do like a hundred percent or like an A I know I didn't get an A just because of how the questions were but I feel confident in the fact that I got at least like a C on it I feel like hopefully fingers crossed I'm 
probably in so much pain right now so i'm about to get in the shower because i don't know i feel like that could like alleviate my pain i'm out of the shower and let me just say that was like the shortest shower i ever took to be honest like i was only in there for like 20 30 minutes that was like the shortest shower i ever took this week like I don't know I'm trying to get my shower time down because one day I'm gonna have to pay my own water bill and I feel like I cannot just be taking hour-long showers every day so I'm trying to get my shower time down but I don't know it's just something about when I get into the shower and the water hits my skin I just like I don't know I just go into like a, a coma or something I just be in there standing there just like staring at the wall doing nothing like just enjoying the warmth of the water i don't know maybe i just need to go somewhere where it's always hot all the time so i won't want to be in a hot shower because i'm always hot i don't know or maybe i should get a bathtub maybe being in the bathtub like the water's not running all the time so maybe that will be cheaper than being in a shower for an hour i don't know i'm talking too much anyways i'm about to play sims <laughs> disappointed because after I got out of the shower and got onto sims my computer was acting weird so I called Fletcher into the room to help me and and the charger like did a thing where it like showed a spark or like did a shock type thing and then my battery just stopped working and now my computer is broken and so I can't play sims anymore I don't know what to do about my computer because I kind of needed that to like edit videos and stuff so I'm in a, I am in distress. So we're going to the market to grab a snack. And then we're going back and I'm reading my Bible and going to bed. And that is all I'm doing for the remainder of the night because I am in distress. We're just here to say bye. What's the Good night. Good morning and happy Saturday. So Fletcher and I are going to True Grits to go eat breakfast. Last night, I woke up with the most terrible cramps. Like terrible cramps. I cannot wait for Monday. It's hopefully my cycle's over so that I can get the ultrasound on Monday so that I can figure out like what's causing the cramps that I am getting because it's like unbearable, difficult to live with. I cannot deal with it anymore. Okay, listen, so before we do our little montage to go to True Grits, last night, something in the room fell over. I don't know what fell over, but it scared the mess out of me. And I was just like half sleep trying to roll towards Fletcher because I was just so, so scared. I don't know, but when I woke up this morning, I realized like I was laying horizontally with like my head facing the door and my feet on Fletcher. So I was like, I did not move the way that I thought I was moving last night. <laughs> to Dollar Tree and Petco with us. Okay guys, look what we got in the store. We got a water wolf reviver. So hopefully that works because we want to like not have to fill the water up all the time because Viver really likes to drink lots of water so we'll see how that goes and also we got new litter box things and guess what we had so much rewards at Petco that we only spent like six dollars for that and it's normally like 75 80 dollars after Texas so yeah we definitely did that but anyways I'm about to take a shower <laughs> to True Grits and unfortunately I don't get the luxury of taking a shower and getting to lay in bed or cook in my apartment because I got a meal plan so we are leaving in my nice clean pajamas to go to True Grits so pray for me all but let's hope for pray let's let's hope and pray for good food at True Grits Fletcher do you what do, what do you think they'll have today um hopefully better food than they have for lunch yeah cuz lunch sucked 
lunch was an L for real. But they did give me a lot of food at lunch, so no complaints there. No. Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm about to spend some time in the toilet. What? <laughs> I'm about to, I'm about to, I have a lactose intolerance, but you know what? You're not getting ice Come cream. Come on, Sadie. When was the last time I had ice cream? I haven't had ice cream in like literal months. Like months. So you're gonna, you're gonna risk your body for some ice cream? Oh yeah, I am. <sighs> See, the thing is, you've done I, it too. I, I would do it too, but lately when I've been eating dairy products, it's like almost been killing me, so I cannot take that risk. I know, but I don't have I don't have it like you do. I don't have that bad of an allergy. Well, I don't even have an allergy. I have an intolerance. You don't. You, on the other hand, physically hurt afterwards. I don't. There's a difference. I don't know. Do you guys think you should eat the ice cream in my face when I want it to? I don't think so. How do you feel about that? Do you think I care? I'll eat it anyway. Oh. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you check out our weekly vlog playlist and I will see you next week. Bye!